For the third week in a row, the night ends victoriously for the Tampa Bay Rowdies as they beat the Minnesota Stars 2-0. to zero. Stay tuned for post-game interviews. In the first half, we were all over them. Uh, I had a good chance. I know Yama had a good chance. We could have uh, put it away early, but uh, unfortunately we didn't. We just kept on at it. And uh, Coming out in the second half, um, we stumbled a little bit in the past, so it was good to uh, come out and uh, put them on their back heel a little bit and get the goal. But um, I thought after we scored the goal, we kind of sat back a little too much. Uh, we didn't really keep the ball that well, and that's something we can improve on. So, um, But overall, uh, Yoshi stuck one in at the end, so a huge insurance goal for us, and uh, we just got to build on the last three games. Uh, today, um, we took control early in the second half, and um, you know that was the, the big part of the game right there, kind of shift momentum, and then uh, we got the goal, so um, it was big for us. I thought as a unit we played really well tonight. Uh, if not for their goalie, their goalie played unbelievable. If not for him, I think we could have won that game three or four nothing. So uh, it was good, you know. It was good to get a comfortable win under our belt. The last two have been kind of uh, a little nerve wracking. So when Yoshi put that second one in, it was kind of a weight lifted off our shoulders. But I thought uh, from the back all the way up to the top, we played really well today. So I mean, everyone's got to be happy with the performance. But you know, we got a quick turnaround Wednesday. So probably enjoy it for the night and then think about Wednesday tomorrow. I couldn't be more delighted with the effort of the players you know, in the last month and, and generally throughout the season, but particularly in the last month, there's been a, an intensity and a, a seriousness to their work. Every day they come to train, every day they try to improve and get better. Every day you know, they put their all in. And you know, my job basically is to try to manage them as people, as individuals, try to keep them as fresh and as hungry as I can do for when Saturday or Wednesday night comes, they're ready and rearing to go. And so what's pleased me tonight was uh, that the level of our conditioning looked quite good throughout the whole game. We were a little bit sloppy after the first 25 minutes in the first half. You know, credit to Minnesota, they came into it and uh, they hit the bar and then we were a little bit edgy at times, a little bit nervous. But during the second period, even though when we were under uh, the barrage of, of long balls and crosses coming in and, and corners, the defenders all equipped themselves very well and the back four in particular um, dealt with most things. The longer the game goes, particularly if we can get our noses in front, and, and if the back four and Jeff, as they have been doing, give us the foundation to, to stay in games, teams get more desperate, they have to throw more men forward, and you know, we have three, four, five quality forwards in our squad, and when it, the gaps be, appear, they're going to exploit them. So I'm hoping you know, the foundation is obviously the defence, who in the last month or so have, have come together and look very, very solid. Um, and I'm hoping they continue that because that gives us the base then for the creative players to enjoy that luxury of knowing that we're still in the game, even though we might not have scored, we're still nil-nil. And if, if they take a chance or make a chance, we can go one up and, and then see if we can get some more. Very, very good composure. A lovely uh, movement off the ball by Mike Ambersley, first and foremost. At one, time, one moment when Keith passed it to Yosha, I felt Yosha was going to put Mike in. Mike made a definite run, a very nice run. But Yoshi thought... OK, it's 1v1, he's 1v1, Mike's 1v1. He slowed it down, was composed at that moment, showed it, dragged it to one side and, and put it in the bottom corner very, very crisply. Um, an excellent executed goal and I'm just delighted that it gave us that breathing space that we needed. Once again, here at Alang Stadium, tonight's final score ends in Tampa Bay Rowdies 2, Minnesota Stars 0.